Alright, so let's get the show on the road, shall we? Let's get the show on the road. Uh, comment section will delete itself momentarily, I hope. I think. I think. Um, but yeah, this is this is Wargroup. This is a game that just came out recently. It is basically a Advance Wars clone, I guess you could say. It's available for all consoles. So, let's go ahead. We're we're gonna go through uh we're, we're gonna go through the story mode, but uh first first things first, I do wanna just kinda show you guys how like the whole crossplay system works. So if any of you guys are interested in doing like, you know, verse mode or whatever, uh you could just quickly I believe you could create a lobby if I could just remember how to create a lobby. But yeah, basically the whole thing uses like a room code system. So if you want to create a lobby, you can create a lobby, play with uh, you know friends, play play with you guys too if you want. Like again, this is cross-play compatible. Uh, they might this this is uh what the heck is this extras gallery codex jukebox cool. Let me just lower the music settings real quick. That is actually kind of loud for 25 percent. Let's just drop that down there. All right. So I'm gonna show you guys, uh, I guess, the campaign mode for this, because this is a great way of uh, figuring out how the game plays. Uh, one rainy night at Cherry Stone Castle, the weather is giving me the spooks. Did you hear that? Cut it out. It's just thunder. But I'm, uh, I'm going to patrol the throne room. Hey, wait for me. All right. I should probably mention this game is from the developers of Stardew Valley, which was a viral hit. Uh, cowards jumping at the shadows and dropping their guard. All right. So, turn one. Oh, I'm playing her. All right. Um, this first level is probably going to be more of a tutorial level of anything. So let's see. Get into the king shouldn't be much of a challenge. There's a king up there. Uh, all alone in his chambers. How convenient. Fewer guards are dispatched, the quicker this will be, but some unfortunate wrench, uh, wretches still stand in my way. I'll start by defeating that one over there. Wait, can I? I wonder, can I turn on, like, grid? Grid mode, maybe? wonder if that's possible. Maybe I have to go through the options. How do I go through the options? I don't think I can uh, go through the options in this screen. Okay, so that's how you move the camera around. Cool probably do yep WASD works as well all right so tutorial okay tutorial yes uh, 38 percent I move right here attack are you afraid goodbye Wow, she just, like, slapped him. Alright, there's the thing. Uh, it's time. Time my daughter learned the truth, but how do I tell her? Alright, well, again, this is just a tutorial, so I don't really expect there to be a lot going on here. Alright, so... Map objectives, alright. What's this button do? I can't, I can't really do a lot right now, huh? Alright. Do we here? Wait. Turn two. Uh, Mercia, a long time ago before Cherry Stone was Cherry Stone. Hmm, no. He's, he is, uh, really pondering how to talk to his daughter. W where is his daughter, anyway? This is laughably, it, it really is. I mean, it's a tutorial stage, so it is kind of laughably easy. I'm, I'm curious, like... Is his daughter somewhere on the map or something? Nope, I don't see his daughter. Alright, well. Just gonna go ahead and attack this guy right here. How foolish. Easy tutorial stage. Easy tutorial <laughs> stage. Very easy tutorial stage. Turn three. Let's see what the king's gotta say. There was once a kingdom called Cacophony. And a war known as the Great Dissonance. Alright. 
See, now I kind of want to skip turn to see what he says. Let's see, we got that knight right there. This is as far as I can walk. What else are you going to say, buddy? Uh, this knowledge is too great a burden. Oh, Mercia. He is... That king is really worried about his daughter. Too bad he's not going to get a chance. This castle is vast. If I access the overview screen, I can get a glimpse of its true extent. I just need to select an unoccupied tile and pick overview. Alright, so, unoccupied tile, overview. Ooh, cool. The screen provides me with objectives and statistics. So many humans, how unpleasant. Still, I can avoid most of them. Uh, as my objective says, I'm here for the king. I can close this now, and I should probably mute this phone. Give me a second here. Let me just go ahead and mute that. There we go. Alright, I can close this now and return to my task. Alright. <laughs> Time to dispose of a few more something. Alright, so... Go ahead and attack you. Are you afraid? <laughs> Like supposed to be an undead or something. I get I get the feeling she's supposed to be like my undead. little bluebird. I'll start slowly, my little uh, my darling bluebird. I need to tell you something. Yep, I'm I really am curious what this king wants to talk to his daughter about, but uh, I don't think he's gonna get the chance to. Over here, easy tutorial. A uh, very long story about something that happened very long time ago. Yeah, sure. Mission. Let's go ahead and just knock him out. How foolish! I get the feeling this <laughs> tutorial is gonna be over in ten turns. That's what it seems like. Turn number seven. <sighs> Very long time ago, indeed. Why can't the past stay the past? Oh, poor king. He doesn't realize he's about to die. Turn number eight. <laughs> At last. You. How did you... What? Sigrid. Okay, <laughs> her name's Sigrid. And the king is definitely gonna die here. Humans are so frail. Do you understand what you've done? You'll start a war! <sighs> the inane squabble of children. Where is the key? Safe hands. You'll never have it. The key is in safe hands. Far from the grasp of a monster like you. <laughs> safe hands. Before you die, understand this. Nothing is safe. Listen. You. You're making a mistake. Hey, what's going on, Cameron? Hush now. <laughs> oh, and there goes the king. <laughs> Rip king. <laughs> well, this was a very easy tutorial stage. <laughs> So I'm guessing she's some sort of undead. Still, the key eludes me. No matter. It's close, I can feel it. Very easy tutorial. Yep, very easy tutorial. Units defeated, four units lost. I mean, I only had one unit. Yes! Well done, princess. Your skill with the cherry blade improves yet further. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, and there's the princess that King never talks to. Woof. Woof. It's alright, Caesar. It's just one of the royal guards. Lord Emmerich. Mm -hmm. Is this important? You disturb the princess's lessons. The king, my lord. The king has been killed. What? Uh, game looks alright, but I don't know about 20 Dree Bones. Yeah, I mean, it's... An, it's... This game is more... Yeah, I mean, it's an advanced Wars clone. clone. No! More or less. I'm sorry. I mean, it is an indie game. $20 for an indie game is pretty much, uh... <sighs> right there. Kind of average for an indie game, actually. Like, the price. Uh, sir, the assailant appears to have been a vampire. The Fel... Uh, the Felheim... Uh, what is that? Felheim Legion? Cool. Uh, Princess Mercia, the murder of your father is an act of war. We must defend the kingdom. War? We're at war. All right. So I wonder which kingdom I'm going to be playing as there. I'm... Congratulations, you've unlocked additional... Ooh, you know what? This might probably be the same as, uh... 
What faction did you choose? I, I didn't choose a faction, actually, because it, like, the story mode just kind of drew me into, uh, something. You know, I'm, I'm guessing I'm playing the undead faction right now, which would be that Felheim Legion. The, it, it just drew me into it. I, w I would assume you get to try out other, other factions, like, you know, later on into the game. Because I, I know each faction has, like, their own unique units and stuff. Um... But I want, can I go ahead and, ooh, grid, yes, let's show grid. Grid would be useful. Combat animation. Eh, let's, let's set it to health bar. Health bars might be useful to have. Adjust difficulty. Oh, I can actually adjust, <laughs> okay. Alright, let's, let's just keep it on default. Let's keep it on default. Let's just keep that on default. Let's not fuck around with that. Alright, so... Uh, that's beginning. That's the tutorial level. So over here would be... Oh, I'm playing as... Them, now. Okay. I'm playing as the other side now. Alright. So wait, does it just, like, change every now and then? It, it does. I, I'm guessing for each map it's probably something you... Uh, a different faction or something. Uh, an unsure Mercia faces her first test as Monarch of Cherry Stone. Let's go for this. Uh, several months later... My queen! Congratulations on your coronation, Queen Mercia. Emmerich, do you really think I'm ready to be a queen? I have no doubt. <laughs> yep, you are your father's daughter. Mm. I hope you're right. Ha! Your Majesty! Thelheim scouts have breached the border! What? They're here. In Cherry Stone, I I should never do voices ever. Let's go. I am terrible with voices. <laughs> Maybe I should take voice acting lessons. I know you can. Uh, and she drops. She leaves her crown behind. She just tosses her crown on the floor. Okay. Wait, Your Majesty, your crown. She just like she just tossed her crown on the floor. She's like, I don't care about this crown. But let's kill this. <laughs> Alright, so, uh, these skeletal warriors are Felmheim troops. We must defeat them all to secure this region. Uh, we should begin by attacking the closest Dreadsword with our unit of swordmen. Right, let's get this over and done with. Alright, so... Wait, can't we, like, also see... Oh, we can't see... I guess this is also part of the tutorial. Alright, that's fine. What is this? Let's move the units to the forest. Okay. So move the unit to the far- I'm trying to move it to the forest. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Notice the numbers that have appeared next to two battle yeah. units. Uh, yeah, there's a little number next to each of them. Uh, these represent the unit's health. They appear when it drops below 95%. The number of five... Oh, it's probably because I changed it to health bar, so I'm not actually seeing that. Hmm. hmm maybe I should probably use badges instead. Uh, swordsman down to about 80%. Very well. Health. Got it. With our second swordsman. All right. My queen, may I interject for a moment? When selecting a target, the damage preview will appear above its head. Yeah, I see it. Damage preview, I mean, it's basically like advanced words, more or less. It's a medieval advanced words, that's what it is. Let's see, more damage a unit take, weaker its attack power becomes, healthy unit is stronger you, well, I mean, obviously. <laughs> Especially since, like, you know, the, the amount of health you have kind of determines how much troops you have on the, uh, in, in that unit. So, there's that. Alright, so what? can we... More, more <clears throat> undead. Seems like they're not giving up quite yet. There's a spear unit over here. Oh, and we got two spear unit. Friendly reinforcements have arrived just in the nick of time. Mm -hmm. Uh, look. It seems like we've been uh, provided with a new unit type. Piker, uh, Pikeman. This might be a good time for you to learn about critical uh. hits. Uh, yes. Uh, all units have conditions under which their attacks are stronger. We call these attacks critical hits. I've never. Okay, this is kind of new. This is kind of new mechanic right here. Not in Advance Wars. I mean, I guess they do have to make a difference some somehow, right? 
Critic. Uh, da, da, da. So each unit. So it, it's. So basically, it, it's using the game mechanics of Advance Wars with Fire Emblem. That's that's basically what this game is. It's it's Advance Wars crossed with Fire Emblem. All right. Uh, slower, more powerful infantry, critical hit when adjacent to another spear. So if I line up a wall of these, these guys would probably be OP or something. Hmm. Here we can find useful information about our selected units. Uh, this part gives us a good over- yep, we, I, we figured that out. Uh, pikemen crits when adjacent to another pikemen. You can bring up this info screen on any unit, terrain, or structure. Use it often and you'll learn fast. Alright, I'll make sure to check it often. When you're ready, you can close this window. Okay, wait. So, when it says it's adjacent to another pikemen, Very well. does diagonal also count or does it have to be, like, you know, right next to it? Okay, we should make sure the pikemen stick together. Got it. Okay, I'm... I'm curious like do diagonals also count i mean if diagonals also count that would actually be pretty useful but uh judging from this i'm guessing diagonals do not count all right so pike lined up our first pikeman let's attack the dread sword with our second one so okay so they have to be right next to each other they can't be uh uh let me damage okay what's going on here arrow is oh is it because i'm attacking their uh their rear that might be it flashing arrow in the damage preview is a good sign it indicates that you're about to land a critical hit i that's obvious hey! that really was a critical mm -hmm. hit that was just one hit i mean it's tutorial yeah so it's kind of obvious but second piper does a critical <laughs> hit she learns fast ha ha Keeping your pikemen together will ensure stronger up. So basically, if I just line up a wall of them together, like just, just a wall of these guys together or something, I might probably have like an unbreakable wall. I'll leave you to defeat the rest of these fellow Thank you. troops. Uh, I couldn't do this without you. Yeah, go f this figure. All right, so let's see. You just gotta defeat the rest of these undead troops here. Let's see, 47 damage, 60 damage. And then this guy can just go ahead and knock this out. Easy does it. Alright, so turn two for the undead. They only got one pikeman left. Oh wow, that did a lot of damage. That hurts, man. That hurts. Eh, do I really want to risk that? Let's not risk that. Let's, uh, let's pull you over here. We're just gonna use you instead. Hey! Uh, that's the last of them. Yep, well done, my queen. Yep. <laughs> All right, we did it. Mm -hmm. Good start, but Felheim won't stop there. We must remain <laughs> vigilant. They'll be back. Yes! Yep. And in great number, I mean, uh, this is a tutorial stage. Of course, they're going to be back. A whole horde of skeletons, indeed. And much else besides. I've forgotten you had so little experience with the undead. Uh, Cherry Stone is normally so peaceful. I've never seen them here before. But now they're coming, and they won't stop. And undead on Ooh, hoo, hoo, undead army. All undead but one. We've spoken in your lesson of their leader, Valder. Mm -hmm. A living man. Yeah. And a necromancer of great power. I haven't forgotten. Uh, well, we should make a move. The undead are likely to be advancing upon other parts of the kingdom. Uh... Emmerich, do you think Valder will come to Cherry Stone himself? Yes. Yes, your majesty, I do. All right. Okay, are we done with the tutorials? He's still chasing... <laughs> he still has the cra Really? He... Really? He's still chasing after her with the crown. Okay, well... Is that is that all the tutorial stages, or are you gonna teach more and more stuff like, um, oh new new stuff about Mercer? Let's see, can I access that codex, Mercia? Oh, I can. 
There's a lot of uh, people here. All right, Mercia must bind her feet as new ruler of Cherry Stone. Da, 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 da. That's oh oh oh. Complete Mercia's arcade. Okay. Sword. Ooh, wait 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 wait. What do we got here? Oh, we have all the uh, the unit types available at least for this faction anyway. The faction that we uh, seem to be currently on. All right, swordsman, pikeman, battle pup, wagon. Transport goods to the market. Not un. Oh, so this is basically like the APC, more or less. Uh, ranger, which is probably long range. Alchemist, probably. Oh, this is like the medic, more more or less medic. All right, warship. It's just more battleship, really. It's like battleship. Yep. So this is the air unit, the Ember Wing flying dragon type thing which is a little cut off there all right knight trebuchet merfolk sea turtle there's a sea turtle unit witch harpy balloon another air unit golem ballista barge villager I would assume, because there, there's a bunch of air units. I'm noticing a bunch of air units. I would assume there's probably going to be a unit that... Because it, it's more or less like rock, paper, scissors between the units. Like, ground units are good against certain units. And then I think, like, the uh, the mounted units are good against foot soldiers and stuff like that, I think. To oh. oh, I could toggle faction. Oh. Okay. Wagon. Yeah, so they basically all have... A roughly about the same uh, types of units, just, you know, different design. Oh, I did Vampire. Alright. Vampire Balloon, Revenants, Ballista, Barge, Villager. Let's see what the, what the faction is this? I don't know what faction. It's a plant-based faction. I, I just noticed it's a plant-based faction. Okay, so yeah, they, they all basically have the same type of units, just different designs. More or less. Floaty thing? Floaty thing? They, they named the... <laughs> it's a floaty thing. Alright. Real creative naming there, guys. And what's... Desert. This seems to be a desert-based faction. Ryu. Tiger Lance. Trebuchet. Kappa. Hogshell. Storm Owl. Tengu. Balloon. Oni. Ballista. That all the fact? Yep, just four factions. Just like Advance Wars. Alright. Let's see what we got. This is probably going to be teaching me about uh, building ah! types, I bet. Ah! Ah! You gotta admit, the pixel animation is kind of no. nicely animated here. Uh, the kingdom's overrun with Felheim soldiers. We have to do something. We will hold what land we can. Maybe if we... Oh, and there's another one. Not so fast. I bet you that's the enemy commander right huh? now. Who are you? I'm the person that's going to smash, bash, and pulverize you! Uh. Alright. So, I'm, I'm assuming she's probably uh, undead. As a, and she's, she's a feisty one, isn't she? She's, she's, she's gonna be a very feisty one. So what is this supposed to be? Like a boss battle or something? Okay, capture mechanic. Okay, so exactly! It's exactly like Advance Wars. Mm -hmm. It takes two turns to capture uh, buildings. Got it. Film Hymen Horde just captured a village. Well, I mean, they didn't cap. They have captured it. They'll attempt to claim the neutral village to the east next unless we stop them. And let's yes. stop them. Uh, Cherry Stone Ranger is here to help us. Okay, we're learning about ranger units now. Rangers are units that attack enemies from a distance. Let's move it to a position from where it could uh, attack any approaching undead. Alright, that's more more tutorial. More tutorial. This is probably going to be the, uh, the RPG unit or something, I bet. From this position, our ranger can attack any enemies approaching from Very the west. Very well. 
Uh, when you want to end your turn, select an unoccupied map tile. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I have auto end enabled, but I guess it's not enabled during tutorials. Ooh, -hoo, more undead are spawning. A lot more undead are spawning. <laughs> Are you remembering to check the unit info screen to learn about crits? Yep. Alright. Attack without moving. Cool. Alright, so basically I just do this. But since we don't want the archer to move, we... Oh, select the same tile again. So that's... Okay, so that's how you make the thing not move. Alright. Yeah! We have. We may have defeated those soldiers, but did that blah blah. It's uh, enemies own barracks. This will enable them to recruit new units. I mean, we have barracks here as well. I mean, can just just hurry up and show me how to use the barracks already. Okay. Yep. All right. So let's see. What can we? We can only afford a swordsman right now. Uh, three different types: uh, swordman, pikeman, ranger. Uh, due to our current funds, yeah, yeah, yeah. You can only afford a swordsman. Single swordsman can make a big difference. Let's recruit one now. Yep. Note that each barracks can only recruit a single. Yeah, make sure to remember that. Okay. Turn three. Okay, select our new swordsman in order to capture the village. Yep. Okay, wait, so it's just one capture, that's all it takes, not two. <laughs> Excellent work, villages bring in 100 gold every turn. Uh, incredibly important to the war effort, right? Because more gold means we can record, uh, recruit more units, correct? In fact, we can cripple the enemy's income by taking their village. Yes! Capture a village that is owned by a different faction, we must first <sighs> defeat it, then I'll recruit more units straight away and order them towards that village. Yep. Some units are more effective than others at defeating structures such as villages. I advise you to rely on Pikeman's powerful crit for this job. Alright, so buy a Pikeman. It's basically it's basically telling me to buy a Pikeman. Alright. Turn four. They recruited another swordsman, and we got two more swords. Oh boy, they they just get reinforced every <laughs> return right now. Enemy reinforcements to the north. They'll no doubt be heading towards your uh, northern villages. I should have known they wouldn't make this easy. Of course, they're not gonna make this easy. I suggest you don't leave the northern path unattended. I'll make sure to leave a unit to protect northern villages. I mean, we we currently do have the uh, archer, although we should probably. I, I guess we should probably move a uh, unit up, huh? Alright, so let's go... Wait, we should be able to see... Yeah, we could see their distance. So if I if I plan accordingly... Like, if I move this unit right here... Yeah, if I, pl yeah, if I plan this accordingly, I could definitely pr uh, prevent my unit from taking damage while dealing damage to their unit on the next turn. Yeah, let's do that. So, where where's this guy going? He's going over here. Alright, so... Well, no, wait. No, that's his, that's his attack range. Move, movement range is up to here. So, attack range is any of these three tiles. Let's just move you over here, then. Uh, we got uh, two... Okay, so... Let me think. Uh, let's move you up. Hmm, wait. Because we do need another pikeman, don't we? Because these these pikemen are better if there are... Unless I can buy multiple units at once. Though that, I don't think that's probably going to be the case. Alright. We'll move this pikeman up here. Uh, we will grab another pikeman, recruit. Yep, okay, so I can only do one at a time. Alright, we, we should have a bit of time before these two units come up here, up to the north. So, uh, next turn we can just build a swordsman and try to get the swordsman up there, I guess. And uh, you can just keep waiting here. Okay, so they're, they're approaching from the north right now. Turn five. Hey! 
These pikemen are really great when they're together. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Alright. Uh, actually, we could probably move this... Yeah, I mean, we could basically move the swordsman up right now to try to intercept these guys. Why not? Let's do that. Alright, um, we want to try to keep our pikes together. Your movement range extends up to... Okay, so th this is your attack range right here. Attack range is here, right? So we could basically move you up here, I guess. We don't need to worry about that. Uh, let's get a another swordsman. I'm gonna get some swordsmen up north. And uh, you could just keep waiting. Turn six. Let's see your range. Checking your range. Checking range. Let's move you over here. Quickly get rid of you. Hey, hey! Easy does it. Get rid of that one. Uh, wait, wait, wait. What, how? What's their range? Okay, range of attack up to here. Um, what's my attack? Ooh, I can attack right now. I fucked up. <laughs> I, uh, that's... Okay, well, I don't think I could undo that move. I was gonna move him. I thought I could attack him. That was not the case. I could not attack him. Alright, so your maximum moving range is all the way up to here. Um, and then we do have another one right there. Your attack range goes up to here. No, wait. Moving. Wait. Yeah, I totally fucked up. I was supposed to attack. I didn't attack like an idiot. Yep. Alright. That's, uh... That's okay. That's okay. We could just quickly just plan around this. Um... Just move you... See your movement attack range is right here. Maximum attack range over here, so we should be able to move you right here. Let's move you over here, and uh, I guess let's get a let's get another. Do we want a ranger. Yes, yeah, screw. It. We're we're just gonna flood the north with swordsmen. Flood the north with swordsmen. Okay, it's not giving me an attack option. I thought we were supposed to... I'm so confused about this. Alright, whatever. Uh, 54 damage up here, unless... Wait, let me see something. Can I view... Can I view how... Ooh, there we go. Ooh, increased bonuses. Defense bonus. And field bonus, one defense. Ooh, in that case, in that case, I should move you right here. Be like, boom, get that defense bonus, man. Get that defense bonus. Get that defense bonus. That's how it's done. Alright, let's see. This guy's gonna be an issue, right? Okay, so how do I... Because I'm supposed to be able to just attack him by not moving him. Guess not. Alright, wait. Uh, 60% damage. 57% damage. This guy's gonna fucking march into my thing. Need to get rid of him. Okay, we gotta do this. Get rid of him. Okay, so he's got a pretty long attack range. Let me move you over here. And move you up here. It's just a box in my thing here. Uh, attack range on you is pretty far. Let's try to take the city. Take the city! Oh wow, that town's almost down. 
Ow, 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 that hurts. I'm capturing this village. This is my village. I'm gonna leave my troops open, though. What? <laughs> okay, wait. Mm, wait, he's gonna fucking march right back in there. Um, wait. Uh, let's, let's send over... You know what? Let, let's send let, let's send over some more pikemen towards the uh, west. Yeah. Ah, okay. Well. Uh, okay. Well. Rift, Rift, Rift Rangers. Oh wow! The Rangers are almost dead. Yeah. Okay. I, I should have expected that. Ooh. It doesn't help that the pikemen are uh, not next to each other. I was kind of expecting you to, uh, you know, capture the city, but I guess not. In that case, I'm capturing the city. Hey, hey! It's my city now. Ah! Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. All right, let me quickly get rid of you. Oh my brave and noble! Oh wow, they're not dead yet. Okay, wait. Um, definitely get rid of you now. Just go ahead and get rid of you. And then I believe if I send a unit into town, that would probably recover them, right? No, I can't send them into town. No. Okay, so it's not like advanced wars then. All right, we'll move you back here. Um. 50% the, should be enough to kill him. Yep, more than enough to kill that dude. Alright, we just gotta watch out for this one. Let's hurry up and start moving some of these troops over. Let's, uh, let's go ahead. Why not? Make another pikeman. Let's reinforce these pikemen on the uh, west front here. They don't have money to afford any more units, so we, we're basically golden at the moment. I do... Let's see, wait, what's your attack range right there? So, let's try to play this... Let's try to play this right. Let's try not to get attacked. Reinforce what? Wait, 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 wait. Are you telling me? Are you telling me in order to heal my units? Wait. 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 That's how I heal my units? I really wish I knew that. Really wish I knew that earlier. Okay, well, we know how to heal units now. Let's, uh, let, let's just swarm the battlefield with pikemen. We have way too much money now. Ooh, oh, oh, you motherfucker. Okay, well, I was kind of hoping he would attack. Um. Okay, well, I was hoping he would attack these units, but he didn't attack these units. That's absolutely fine. We're just gonna... Get rid of you. Yay! Wait. So I just need to be right next to them. Oh, it takes some of the health. I see it takes some of the health. Alright. What's your attack range? Your attack range is pretty weak. Uh, let's just move you down here. Let's, let's get a nice little wall of pikemen set up. Just for, uh defensive purposes I mean they, they're all gonna crit like as long as they're right next to each other they will go they, they, wow. that it really does take health from the um thing so that's how you heal units apparently let's go ahead dad just keep swarming the field with pikemen yep 
He's getting freaked. I see, I see. Wait, so if there's not enough health on these buildings, that means these guys won't really recover much, huh? Alright, okay. I get it. I get it. Let's see... Let's do... Um... Trying to think here. You could just move you up here, I guess. Try, try to keep these pikemans together. As long as I keep the pikes together, they'll all get buffs from each other. And then... We have... Just... Kind of some knights, I guess. Okay, you know what? I could probably stop producing units at this point because I probably have way too many units now. Like, way too many units. <laughs> yeah, I should just stop producing units. I don't. I. I don't really need this many units to swarm them, do I? We're, we're just. We're just gonna stop producing units. I don't need this many units to swarm them. Okay, maybe I do. If I, if I just bum rush them, I, I'll definitely take this. I should just bum rush. Wow, you're still alive. How are you still alive? You know what? I'm I'm just gonna bum rush you at, at this point. Seriously, I'm just gonna bum rush this this dude. Just 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 fucking build swordsmen and just bum rush the fuck out of them. Doesn't matter how what? many new units you bring out, you're you're <laughs> get wrecked. Okay, well that pikeman is dead. Rip this pikeman. Oh, my first loss. How terrifying. You're gonna... I mean... Okay, well, I mean, that was a, basically a suicide attack on your part. Okay, I mean... I, I guess you're... Just suicide yourself. Sure. That's... That's cool. Let's do... Wait. Can you... Yes, you can move over here. Okay, so we can just move you over here. Let's just go ahead and uh, charge your fucking castle here. And then uh, what we're gonna do is basically get rid of your unit right here. I'm going for total victory at this point. I will settle for nothing less than total victory. I will settle for nothing less than total victory. Complete domination. Oh damn. I don't have the uh, distance to move there. I'm going for complete domination. Yeah. How does it feel not having any money to be able to recruit any new units? Well, I can just continuously bum rush you with units. Yep, I I have two fucking two two thousand gold. <laughs> this is how Advanced Wars is played. You just <gasps> bum rush the shit out of them. Get wrecked! Hey, hey, hey. Oh man, I can't wait to unlock the aerial units. No! I'm I'm not gonna lie. Back back when I was a kid with a Game Boy Advance with Advanced Wars, you know. Uh, what, what character was it? Ego, I think that was his name. He he was probably the most overpowered character in Advance Wars. Because, um, he had, like, this <laughs> special skill or something that uh, enabled all your mechanical units to move again at the end of the turn. And that, that shit was just, like, 
that was fucking <gasps> OP. You just fucking blitzkrieg the crap out of the other teams. <sighs> with, with tanks, with fucking bombers, all, all that shit. That, that was fun. But seeing that it's mostly gonna be, uh, you know, medieval units in this game. <sighs> said go away. Oh, it's yeah. you. Yeah. Yeah. Uh... I didn't mean to disturb you. <gasps> she didn't disturb me. I was lying in wait. Huh. Uh huh. Right. Shut up! <laughs> She's mad. This isn't over. She's mad. Somebody's mad. Aw. Oh, it's not a three star. Well, I mean, we did lose one unit, so. We did lose one unit, so it's probably why it's not three star victory. You unlock Bellheim in the Codex. Cool. Alright, well, let's just go ahead. Worst enemies forever. Unhappy with her defeat. Ragna decides to take Matt. Okay, what's gonna happen? Whatever! So you won. Who even cares? Ugh. All you did was beat up a few lousy, stinking skeletons. Oh, that skeleton god is feeling back. hurt. I care. I won't stop until my kingdom is safe. <laughs> Look, you know, we have a dog. Alright, we have a dog. And their entire army of uh, uh, are skeletons. Why don't we just sick the dog on the entire army? I mean, you know, bones. Dog I'll bones, crush right? you. Crush myself. <laughs> All right, Ragna, what's going? Ooh, we have a knight mm -hmm. that's being injured. Move deep into this region. She's got Ian Stronghold. A stronghold is a really important structure that anchors a faction to a region. To win, we can either defeat the stronghold or Ragna herself. There's Ragna right there. There's the stronghold. I understand. I'm joining this fight personally. Look over there. One of our knights has uh, beaten us here. Knights are strong, fast-moving units. However, they're unable to capture structures. Only infantry and commanders can do that. Uh, knights sound great. Let's <laughs> get started. Hold your horses. It seems we'll get uh... on health. Well, I mean, we kind of figured that out in the previous game. We just, you know, can't park it right next to a fucking thing and spend some gold. Reinforcements come into play. Simply move a wounded unit next to one of your structures. Yeah. Select reinforce. Yeah, I, I think we figured that out the last game. Man, this this tutorial is slow. It's like, you, you're already figuring out the stuff already. But yeah, that's fine. We'll just reinforce. <laughs> Yes! Reinforcements. First, reinforcing a unit costs an amount of gold proportionate to that uh, unit's value. Second, the health restored to the unit is taken from the health of the structure. Got it. Reinforcement costs gold and transfers health from the structure. Okay, I should start by taking control of these barracks in nearby villages. Yep, definitely. That's captured this thing. Alright, so, barracks captured. Except I can't use the barracks yet. Alright, let's see. How are we gonna plan this? How are we gonna plan this? Alright, they got... They, how much gold are they getting right now? One, two... I, I mean, I'm, I'm guessing this provides gold as well per turn. Right? Mm -hmm. As commanders, you and Ragnar are both powerful units on the battlefield. You can easily take down most infantry units and enemy structures single-handedly. Make uh, the most of your strength as a commander without risking your neck. Remember, the team that loses the commander also loses the I won't the let you down! Okay, so this is basically a key unit. Um, let's take a look. Yeah, this... Okay, so strongholds also provide gold. Barracks do not. So they're making 200 gold right now. I'm making 200 as well. Probably capture that real quick. While we got I'm the going chance. Alright, so knights. What are knights effective against? Uh, let's see... I really wish I knew what the fuck any of this means. Okay, wait. Dogs? What is this? Dreadnought? Horn? Yes. Okay, so you're you're effective against these uh these type of units. So we should definitely uh, make use of that. Okay, so your movement range is up to here, right? No, that's your attack. So we're gonna move the knight right. Let's get this knight in right now. 
We're gonna we're gonna make use of our knight here. So move the knight right over here. Then let's go ahead. Ooh, we could definitely make Ooh! I am tempted. Okay, wait. Um Let's get some uh pikemen going. Yeah, pikes. Pikes are gonna be useful. Okay, they're on to the retreat right now. <laughs> Alright, Ragnar just recruited a Dread Spear of Felmheim Spearman. It would be prudent to check the Spearman's. Yep, I know. Check it. What are you effect? You are effective against. It looks like knights? This table tells us which units the Spearman is especially effective against, which I'm seeing knights. Oh no, it says they're effective against. Yep. Oh, that's cavalry right there. Okay. Spearmen will deal extra damage against units such as their knight. Go ahead and close this. Yep. Okay, so you are vo what? You're vulnerable to... Okay, so... We probably don't want to move the knight up there. <laughs> <laughs> yep, just click that. We already know. By holding this button, you can display how far the unit can move. Awareness of the movement. Yep, I noticed. Good thinking. Yep. All right. So you know what? Let's move. Awareness of the movement range. Yep. We'll take this guy up here. Uh, we'll move you. See how far is your attacking range? Ooh, they're gonna they're gonna attack this. I see it. They're going to be able to attack this. I need to be able to defend that. Let me think. I might just need to sacrifice it for now. Get some pikemen's going. Alright, they're going they're going to attack my little cast uh town here. Yep, I knew it. It's okay, they're not gonna be able to take it over. And we will deal some damage to them. Interesting. Uh part of Cherry Stone is more forested than I remember. Yes. We may be able to use this to our advantage. Uh different terrain types. Yes, we already know about terrain types. Man, these tutorials are really mm -hmm. slow. It's like you you learn about half of this stuff just by poking around in like the previous tutorials. All right, well you know what your thing is dead here. Let's just go ahead and kill this guy. Get that shit out of here. Get off my fucking side of the field, man. Useless <sighs> skeletons. If you surrender, we can just end this now. We don't have to keep fighting. <laughs> Oh, alright, well, I mean, this skeleton's gonna die, too. Go, my cavalry units! Just completely annihilate them! Alright, let's keep the pikes together. Uh, we're gonna move... Commander unit up here. Move the knight up here. Try to intercept that guy. Uh, oh, we can afford another knight. Wait. Do I want to do that, though? Let's see. Who's effective against the, uh... What is this? That's the, uh, pike. Who's effective against the pike? Uh, pike. Pike, pike. Who is effective? Oh, the ranger is effective against pike. Okay. Right? This is pike, right? I'm assuming that's pike. I mean, it looks like it. I'm going to assume that's pike. Alright, let's, let's, let's build a ranger. Get a ranger up here. Turn four. Ooh, what do we got here? What do we got? What is this? What is this? What do you have here? You have a archer. All right. That you're going to use against my soldier, I guess. Yes, you are. All right. In that case, I should probably... Uh, ooh, your attack range. Okay. Let me think. How am I going to do this? What is it effective against, by the way? Uh, you are in effect. 
I don't even know what the f codex. Oh, oh, actually, that actually helps. That 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 does help. All right, wait. So the cavalry unit is basically this horse-looking thingy, which you are effective against for whatever reason. You are effective against that. Right, red doggy thing. No, it's not. Oh no, you are weak against that. Okay, so I should probably send my cavalry unit towards you. Uh, while at the same time trying to make sure I don't get fucking wrecked here. What are you weak against? You're not weak against anything. Let's see, how do I want to do this? We could take out the commander. Okay, what is your movement range right now? Your movement range goes up to here, so we could just move you back one. Let's move you back one. Let's retreat you back one. Your movement range... Okay, so we're gonna move Knight over... Movement range, checking... That's gonna put my knight in movement range. I didn't pay attention to that. That's okay. We'll just move you here. And uh, let's get a. Let's see. She's coming up north, right? So. Get another swordsman. Oh wow, she has a much longer movement range than that. Yeah! She, she had a much longer movement range than I was expecting. Oh, I, I need to start reinforcing up north. Okay, we need to start reinforcing up north. yourself ow Okay, this is, uh, this is, this is getting interesting here. Oh, wow, she could wipe! I wasn't Take expecting this! that! Yeah! Okay, she could walk through water. Unexpected. We just gotta carefully plan this here. I won't fail. This is mine. No. Get rid of you. Wow, it's not dead yet. Okay, I would. I was actually hoping that would do a lot more damage than it did. Hey, hey! Let's start attacking their base.
Okay, this knight is pretty much fucked. I should probably hurry up and make another knight. Um, we're gonna move you right here. Let's go ahead and make another pikeman. Fight me! Okay, this, this town is fucked. Yeah! Yep. Alright, she took that town over. Damn, these commander units are fucking tough. Take down your main camp here. If I take out your barracks, I'm thinking, if I take out your barracks, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna take out the barracks. Stop her from making units. I won't hold back! Huh? We stop her from making units, and then we could probably bum rush her. Yeah! Oh, I should have used the forest square. She uh, she took a lot less damage than I was expecting. City. I'm taking this. She's going for the sound again. I'm getting surrounded up here. That's not gonna be good. Okay, 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 okay. Out. We're almost there. Let's see, she's gonna do a lot of damage to me. She's gonna go ahead and capture this. Hey, hey! I'm gonna have to start swarming the field. It's the only way we're gonna get through this. I'm basically trying to keep them occupied right now. Um... Move a knight up here. Uh, let me get a, uh... Build some more pikemen. This is not going to be good. Because I am taking a lot of damage right now. I should probably pull her back soon. Oh, fuck me. I need to pull her back. I need, I need to pull her back. Should 
Charge! <laughs> It was worth the sacrifice! Hey, hey! It was worth the sacrifice! It wasn't. I won't what? fail! Oh, <laughs> son of a bitch! Okay, so, um, that's not good. Rid of you! We, we really need to start hammering on her right now. Um... Hammer on her. God, why is she not dead yet? She's such a pain in the ass. I I might actually lose this battle because uh, shit, she doesn't have a lot of health left. looking at like I might lose this battle it's looking like I might lose this battle oh boy. this is nope okay well I think I'm done here okay yep poor planning on my part totally poor planning on my part totally poor planning on my part Which does this have left? OBS is disconnected and reconnected. Weird thing. Let's just make sure everything is still running. Just uh, make sure that's still running here. It says OBS has disconnected but reconnected. I'm not sure if it's actually reconnected though. Because everything is uh, broken. Why is everything broken? Okay, no, I, I'm sure it's fine. Alright. I lost that to the boss mode. Yeah, I mean, I, I almost fucking lost this battle to be honest. I almost lost this one. It, it, it was it was almost poor planning on my part. No. I almost fucked this one up. Uh. Uh, it seems pretty difficult to have reasonable conversation with you. Let's just make sure. Yeah, it's running. Okay, I'm going to go. Yep. Yeah. You, I'm not running. You just suck. I. It, it was almost poor planning on my part. To be honest. Uh. Almost poor planning on my part. Almost. Lord Valder. Ragna. Quiet, Ragna, you disgrace yourself. <laughs> Stand aside and let me fix your mess. Oh boy. One star. Of course, one star. I mean, that, that was kind of a mess of a fight, to be fair. Alright, let's see. With Cherry Stone overwhelmed, Mercia must get her people to save. Okay, so this is probably gonna be some escort mission. Hmm. So we meet at last, Queen Mercia Cherry Hi, Queen. That's Valder, Lord of Thelmheim Legion, Master of Bell Gauntlets. Valder! That's Valder? Oh no. <laughs> Ragna has power but lacks discipline. I fell sh I fall short on you. <laughs> this is a battle we cannot you know I get the feeling, I get the feeling. The story is probably gonna be the same as Advance mm -hmm. Wars. Uh the Gloomwoods, it's our only hope. Where like, you know, you, you start off with a, a, a army that's basically losing the war. 
but then a greater good, like a greater enemy pops up that threatens the world, and everybody has to team up on it. <laughs> We're probably gonna team up with Valder sometime down the line, I bet. Uh, does the Queen of Cherry Stone give up her throne so easily? It's okay, Let's see. go. Let's start the retreat. We have no choice. I mean, the last battle was kind of rough. All right, let's see how we huh? got here. What do we got? As word spread, does everyone know we're leaving? They do. The citizenry is already on the move. Uh, there's a villager right there. They're coming by the rest road, but the Felheim Legion isn't far <laughs> behind. We have to get them out of here fast. Mm -hmm. Okay, so there's the escape points. Yeah. Use the wagon. Vehicles like these cover a lot of ground. On roads especially, they're the fastest way to reach the front line. I suggest you climb into this one yourself and then order it out towards the villager. Load up! Yes! Now you can move the wagon south, closer to the location of the villager. The wagon can only hold one unit at a time, and villagers count as a unit. When you arrive, exit the wagon using crops so that the villager can climb aboard. Alright. Okay, I made it. I better get these wheels. Yes! Yep. Uh, with the wagon near the barracks, you'll be able to ferry more units to your side. Alternate the use of the wagon to transport your troops to battle and the villagers to uh, yeah. safety. Yep, alright. Load up. Alright, question is, the big question is, which direction are they going to come from? I see there's three directions, which means three possible points of entry to defend, and there's the retreat point right there. So we, we have to cover quite a bit of distance here. Let's see. Okay, so the villagers are coming from here, right? Which means I should probably... Let's see. Alright, we'll have the pikemen defend up north here. And we'll move the, uh, I guess we'll move the knight down south. Because, again, I'm, I'm not sure which direction they're going to come in from. Oh, we have another wagon here. We can definitely make another wagon if we need it. Yo, let's make another wagon. Wagons are going to be handy. All right, so where, which direction are they coming? They're coming in from the south. No. So Commander, you're strong enough to handle this first wave on your own. Okay, so they're coming in from the south. I gotta start moving my troops to the south. Okay, so what do we got here? We got a uh, archer and we got two swordsmen. All right, so let's see their movement range here, up to the village. This guy's definitely going to be able to attack the village. It's got a long attack range. All right, so I think if I move, yeah, let's just move him here. And then we need to build some uh, units. Let's see, we need to be able to move some units down. So, I think the knights are probably gonna be my best friend. Hey, Axe, how you doing? Yep, I'm doing great, Ryan. You know, we're just checking out this new game that came out a couple of days ago called uh, War Groove. It's it's basically an advance. Oh man, they're they're coming in from the north now. Okay, all right, okay, sure. All right, you know what? In the, in that case, these pikemen could just wait up here. These, these pikemen can just wait up here. What, what are their movements? Okay, attack range over there. That's fine. These pikemen up here. Um, let's get this villager the fuck out of here. Drop you here. Get out. Very well. First of the villagers have made it safely. Keep going. Yep. Okay, so villagers are coming from here, right? So let's get this wagon ready. Alright, so let me think, let me think. 
I need to be able to quickly alternate between units here. Alright, so I have to defend here, defend here. Villagers coming from here, exit here. So, let's see, how am I going to get units out quickly? It's 30%, 85%, 135% right here. Quickly get rid of the archer, I guess. That is a that is something we could do. Quickly get rid of the archer. What? Get rid of the archer. I won't hold back. Oh, strategy game. Strategy games are always fun. All right, let's get rid of that. Eighty-five percent on these guys. Let's get rid of you first. This night down here. Uh, let me get. Uh, let's see, Rangers. What are Rangers effective against? Uh, you guys are effect. You definitely effective against the um, thing up there. Let's see, if I just move, maybe if I move the Ranger like around somewhere. I need to. Let's see. I'm. I'm trying to think. Like Ranger. If I move. Let's. I can't. I can't afford a ranger, though. All right. Let's make some. Uh, let's make some pikemans. Let's make some pikemans. Let's try to reinforce the northern side here. My queen. This is not good for this town. This town is looking rough. I want to be able to keep these towns running here. Uh, Ryan says, hate to tell you, dude, but without your wisdom teeth, it hurts so damn much. I've already taken well over the, uh... <laughs> hey, don't worry, dude. Look, I, I had teeth removed before. The pain will, uh, dissipate after a while. Dude. Dude. Yeah, it'll dissipate after a while, but, um... Yeah, you, you, you're probably not gonna be able to eat any solid foods for... Maybe at least a week or two, at the very least. So, um, yeah, there's that. All right, let's go ahead. Wait. <laughs> but uh, yeah, dude. I, ho hopefully, hopefully, uh, you know, you you get through the uh, worst of it. Um, soon. Go. What's their movement ranges? Let's see, you can attack me right now. I don't want you to attack me. I could definitely smack you down if I want to. Ooh, but they got two pikes. Ooh, those pikes are gonna be effective against my horsemen. Yeah, they're effective against horse. I uh, may need to uh, rethink this. 90% damage. You know what? Do it. I may need to rethink this. I may need to rethink this threat. Um, let me think. What What's weak against these guys? Uh, archers. I need some archers out. Out front and center. Get some archers out here. Alright, um, let me just pull these guys back here. Because these, 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 uh, these fucking pikemen are gonna be a problem here. Your attack, movement range, attack range... Three, two, one. Okay, you're a swordman. So I could just move you back one. Start moving some of these pikes down. Uh, get a ranger unit up in here. How many of these villagers do I have to, uh, you know, rescue. Okay, right now, right now the north is pretty well defended for the time being. Oh wow, you actually move a lot further than- Oh right, because you're on road! Because you're on road.
I feel I my don't know. queen. Ooh, yes. Special moves. Grooves are a gift. Commanders like you and I charge them as we battle. Uh, you must use your groove to benefit your forces. I want to use it to heal them. Focus your energy and cast a healing aura. It will restore some measure of health to you and any nearby friends and as A tactical advantage. Oh. That'd be useful, for sure. That would definitely be useful. Uh, let's see. So I think the nurses had bruised my jewelry line and made it impossible to open it. Yeah, that's usually what they do. They like inject you with like a little uh, a pain painkiller or something, and and basically just extract the two from there. Yeah, but uh, you, you, you're basically going to be having a lot of soup-based food. Seriously, just may as well do, like, I don't know, hot pot or something. Soup-based foods, most soup-based foods. You know what? I think if I were to line up units along here, I might be able to just cut off their thing. Which one is the loaded one? This one's the loaded one. Here, uh, let's see. I need to get another pikeman out here because that pikeman's not going to be good by himself. Jawline. Yep. Yep. Trust me, I I, I had teeth pulled before. I I know exactly what you mean, dude. That shit hurts like a bitch, but. You gotta do it, you gotta do it, you know? Hey, hey, hey. I feel like my northern border is very well secured right now. Just, I'm just worried about these guys down here. Because it, it, it's gonna hurt. You know what I could do? Because I do have the healing aura. I could just weaken them. Now. <laughs> Even though my units are technically weak against them, I could just use the healing aura. <laughs> that seemed like a strat. I just need to hold him off for now, that's the thing. So, Healing Aura... I'm here to help! Healing Aura! Heal up. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, so, basically my commander is more of a medic, if anything. That would be handy. <laughs> it's like Andy's repair, basically. Yeah! Alright. I'll save you all. Working on it. Right now, I have a bit of an advantage here, so... Problem is, uh, yep, that's gonna do a lot of damage to me. I need to, I need to keep feeding units down south. That's a suicide attack if I've ever seen one. Uh, other news as well, I've also got my new game, Kingdom of... Nice, lucky you, dude. Uh, the postal service... Yeah, I know, they, there was a delay for the um, snow and all that, I know. Uh, trust me, dude, living up here in North Minnesota at negative 77 is no laughing... I'm, I mean, technically, North Minnesota is not supposed to get that cold. I think it's only cold because of that polar vortex that's in the area. Alright, load up. Get moving. Get these wagons moving. Alright, uh. Tss, tss. Oh, 
Oh wow, you're still alive. How are you still alive? 60%. I just need to slow him down. That's that's a strat. We just need to slow him down. Let's get some archers over here. Get that archer moving. to reinforce my northern border soon because uh seriously these units up here are kind of getting wrecked <laughs> definitely need to reinforce the northern border all right all right uh let me think how am i gonna do this the southern border is probably the more uh, important one to reinforce at the moment just go ahead we can do I won't hold back! Let's see, let's get some, uh... Let me think. We got some pikemen moving over there right now. We are going to have to pull these guys back. Um... Could probably make another wagon, that way I could at least transport troops quicker. We'll make another wagon. That way we could at least transport troops. You're also taking a lot of damage. I'm gonna have to pull you back before you get yourself wrecked. Seeing that you're my commander unit. This is gonna hurt. Ooh, that's. Ooh, I only got four bars of health left. I need to pull you back. Okay, that's a suicide attack, but you do you, I guess. That's okay, just keep suiciding on me. Okay, yep, alright. Okay, wait, we got archer units up here. Yeah! I'm just gonna slowly weaken them all. That's okay. Not good. We need, we need, uh, what is this? What are you? You, you have a fucking villager. Get that villager out of here. Let's get this thing waiting for the next villager. Blow it up. Drop off. Uh, you are kind of getting a little bit too cocky over here. I need to uh, kind of rescue you right now. D small town, Thief River Falls, Minnesota, because that's where... It Is that where you live? By any chance? Thief River Falls, Minnesota. I'm going to assume that is probably where you live. Ow, 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 ow. Let's get some more wagons. We need we need to up the reinforcement here. Turn seven. This is not good for any of my pike units. I'm losing the battle in the north here. I'm, I'm getting wrecked in the battle of the north. It's gonna hurt. Okay, you suicide attack on that. That's perfectly fine. That works for me. You just keep suiciding yourself there. I'm 
gonna try something. I'm gonna try something. If I camp on these... If I camp on these squares, did that prevent them from spawning? I'm gonna try that. Let's try it. If it prevents them from spawning, then that's all the better for me. Get an archer unit up here. We need to get, uh... Well, let's get some knight units out here. Get some knights out here. Get this wagon back over here. That way this wagon can wait for the next uh, reinforcement. They also have a uh, cavalry unit up there. There's no merging units. I'm losing the battle up north here. So, I'm gonna have to do something about that. I need another pikeman down here, or at least two or three more pikemen down here. Should have enough wagons to start transporting people all over the place, though. Ow. Ooh, this is gonna hurt. Okay, well, that pikeman is fucked. No, I've lived 16 miles northeast... Uh, Rozu, Minnesota. Cool. Alright, alright. Uh, let me think, let me think, let me... I'm losing the battle up north. Oh, okay, nope, that didn't work. I was hoping that would work. It did not work. It, it just spawned him around. Okay, okay, nope, uh... I should rethink my strategy here. None shall I, I fall while well, I, I should still rethink stand. my strat here. Healing aura. I, I was really hoping that would work. It did not work. Correction system 60. Oh, 60 miles. Get rid of you. Yeah, usually I usually turn off auto correct on my phone. I absolutely hate it. Oh, I forgot to move this night unit and buy a unit. Shit. Okay, well this north northern north. I gotta I gotta fix my northern battle here. Uh, you have a fucking villager. Just go ahead, drop that off, please. Thank you. Okay, I need to start, uh, dropping fucking units like crazy here. Get an extra pike unit. Oh, that's kind of suicide. You over here. Hmm? Okay, okay, one more, one more villager. Alright. Oh shit, they have another pike unit. Ooh, okay, rip knight. Okay, well, get, get, get this pike fought hard. It wasn't enough. I, oh boy. Okay, I think my knight has the advantage here. At least they should. Oh yeah, they definitely have the advantage there. That's gonna be a problem. Load up, get this last villager out of here, and let's retreat ourselves. Load up. Fire in the hole.
you. I won't hold back. Huh? All right, we need to start moving north. Okay, so once this last villager is out. Alright, yep, suicide attack that, no problems. You do you. Suicide it. Yeah. More units are popping in right now. Lots lots of units are popping in right now. Oh man, <laughs> that's that's a fucking army. Vald Your Highness! I won't let you down. Alright, it, it's time for a massive retreat here. My queen. New objective, get mercy out of safety. Mercy is kind of surrounded at the moment. Load up. I just need a distraction. I need you guys to go distract for me. I know, I know I'm sending you guys off to your death, but you guys need a distract for me. A rough battle. There's gonna be a real rough battle. All right, all right. We just need to get Mercia out of here. And we are go. Okay, well, rip that nine unit. This is this is starting to look like a really rough retreat right now. This is this is looking like a really rough retreat right now. They're not attacking the caravan yet, which is good. By my hand, rise! Oh boy, no, 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 you don't do it. no, bad. Okay, crap. Just need to start retreating. Just need to start retreating. Caravan's still safe. I don't know for how long though. have to get ready to prepare to defend the northern front. Oh, no you don't. Oh, shit. Ow, ow. Okay, well, that didn't do a lot of damage as I was uh, expecting. It's fine. Ah, retreat! Retreat! It's time to retreat, motherfuckers! 
Time to GTFO! Let's let's throw in another night unit to cover our escape. Yes. Then just move these out of the way. We don't need them no more. Just just move these out of the way. I, I just need to get Mercia up there and we'll be fine. Rip to this village. It, it was a, it's a, you know what, that village stood for a very long time, it, it's a, it's well worth the sacrifice. Yeah, the polar vortex really sucks. At, at least today was a little bit warmer, right? At, at the very least, I hope. Because, it's like, it, it's like 50-something degrees here in New York right now. Compared to the, uh, negative 20 that we had last week. Uh, freedom! <laughs> <laughs> okay, made it. Well, we have to ditch this, uh, this city. Let's... Ragnar! You're still pissed. Yeah! <laughs> I'll hunt them down and turn them into mincemeat! Yeah, I feel sorry for you, Ryan. But yo, I, I hope you're doing everything you can to bundle Sigrid. up, you know. Uh, you know, since, since you did get your wisdom teeth removed, at, at least it's a very good time to have soup. Soup will warm you right up, dude. Mm -hmm. Belheim needs its master. I trust you to oversee this <sighs> task. Very well. Sending two commanders after me now, are you? Okay, well... Oh, wow, I still got three stars from that, even though I, you know, lost six units over there. <sighs> that was close. Yeah, of course it was. We can't rest here. It's not safe. We can't return without reinforcements. Huh? Can't we just regroup it? I mean, look, we just we basically just lost our entire fucking kingdom here. If it, if it even does say zero degrees, it's a warm day. Uh... Dude, just just go ahead, make yourself some soup. You're gonna you're gonna feel so much better when you have some soup. Mm -hmm. Having the strength to do that alone. So what do we do? We need to head east to Haven Heaven Song and seek aid from Empress Tenry. Tenry, your father and the Empress were old friends. If anyone can help us, it's her. That's a long journey. Let's go. We have to try- we- so we basically lost our kingdom and are now seeking refuge in a different kingdom. And the dog probably senses somebody is following us. Okay, wait, what- no? Okay. <laughs> okay, well, there's the green army. Okay, so what's going on? Congratulations, you have unlocked the arcade game mode. Arania in the codex, alright. Uh, what, what what the heck is arcade mode? I have no idea what arcade mode is. You could just... I, I guess it's probably something in the main menu. This is a very vast land. I'm assuming this is probably going to be the site of like the final fucking battle or something. Okay, so, wait, if I've got my assumptions correct, I'm guessing because it's red, blue, green, yellow, right? And yellow is technically everybody in the desert area. I'm guessing green is probably going to be everybody in the forest area. Red's probably this little area right down here. So what? what is blue? Is blue like from this island or something? I'm, I'm guessing that's it because from, from what it, it looks like, blue is the main antagonist here. But it's probably going to be an even greater Evo somewhere. Alright. Yeah. I'm moving to a new apartment. I really... Uh... 
Uh, let's see, how do you... I mean... Probably add, like, a little bit of milk in there just to, like, make the cheese more creamy. I guess. Milk or butter. Uh, party escapes the gloom woods only to face fresh dangers. Alright. Who are these interlopers? <laughs> we don't mean you any harm, Florin. We just need to cross your lands. <laughs> Crossing through the gloom woods. A dangerous hunt. These are Florin lands. This is where we live. This is where we hunt. <laughs> Humans do not come here. Hmm? Cherry Stone Kingdom negotiated the right to safe passage generations ago. I know we don't use it very often, but we need it now. We have no choice. Say, Changers! Where the little lady seeks passage, said seeks sustenance. <laughs> do you threaten the Queen of Cherry Stone? <laughs> Queen. Silly titles do not impress Sedge. Whatever you call yourselves, you're still just meat and bound. <laughs> Sedge will eat the old man first and the little lady for seconds. Or stand down, stranger, be cut down. Alright, so I guess new mm -hmm. command yep, new commander, cool. Forest is so dense in the fog okay, so we're we're now experiencing fog of war. Yes! We should use our battle pups to scout ahead. Uh, pups inflict critical hit when another pup is adjacent to their targets. More importantly, they can see furthest through the fog. We should send one of them up this mountain. Is there a mountain? I don't see... Oh, there's mountains here, mountains there. Mm -hmm. Being a... Oh, there's one there. Uh, extend sight of range, okay. From which... Very well. Okay, move forward carefully. Okay, so... Neutralize the enemy barracks or defeat Sedge, who is probably going to be spawned. Probably start somewhere up here. Alright, so let's see. They got two barracks. No, they don't have two barracks. They only got one barrack. One barrack right now, which means. And then a bunch of neutral. neutral towns, it looked like. So I think, ideally, the first thing I should probably do is capture this barrack, just so I could at least get some unit production going. Uh, it's... Okay, so let's see. Chances are he's going to be capturing a lot of towns before I do. Two, three, four. Each one provides 100 gold per turn. So he's probably going to be making at least 400 gold by the time I, I manage to get to this barrack. Which means I'll be making 400 as well, and then... Alright. So we'll start off with a battle pup up here, up in the mountains, scout ahead. Ugh! Ambush units everywhere! There are ambush units everywhere! Okay! Yeah, this, this is what I need, ambush. Okay, what is this? This is a... Okay, sword, sword, yep, sword. Swordman, swordman, what is this? Swordman. Okay, ambush units everywhere, now that we know there's ambush units. Let's see here. What are you weak against? You are weak against dog. You're basically weak against everything except for the ranger. Alright. So, ranger is basically useless here. But at the very least, we now know there are ambush units, ambush units everywhere. All right, so doggies do more damage when they're when when somebody's a when one of the other dogs are next to it, right? So that uh, that really isn't as much damage as I was hoping, but uh, we'll, we'll take it. Owie, poor doggy, getting hit. Alright, let's, uh, okay, we got ambush units right there, okay. We need these pikemen to be together, and then ranger's gonna have to defend the uh, rear line here. He should be enough to knock him out, yep. What's your distance? Okay. Yeah, that's, an, that's gonna be an attack distance. We'll move you right here. They're not gonna move, okay. Alright, alright.
Okay, so we got an ambush unit up there. Expand my line of sight a little bit further. That's gonna be in your attacking range. Should probably... Let me think. Let me think. Let me think. Although they're not really moving, are they? They're not moving. This is just an introduction to the fog of war, so... What are the chances that the enemy will definitely be moving around? There's another ambush unit there. I have a good reference of a new apartment, three bedroom, one and a half bathroom, your own car garage, nice. Washer and dryer system, master bedroom, twice the size. And a shoe closet, large kitchen with an L-shaped dining table, and all the amenities. You know, that's a very good apartment. Seven, 750 a month? Oh man, the apartments sure are really cheap out there. As, as much as I would love to move into an apartment here in New York, it, it, that that thing's out of my pay range, to be, to, to be honest here. Like, that, that would literally be my in, entire month's paycheck if I were to move into an apartment here in New York, because rent alone, minimum, you're looking at about $1,500 minimum here in New York. That That is way out of my pay range. Tactical advantage. I've never seen an apartment for that cheap. 750 is a steal. That's like only two paychecks to me. Oh, man. Okay, are they actually gonna move now? Yes, they are gonna move now. Alright. I probably shouldn't have moved the archer unit there. Oh, oh, and there was another ambush unit right there. Ow! My poor doggies! I should have probably moved them in tightening groups. Oh, my poor doggies! My poor doggies! Okay, I should have probably moved them in groups. Yep, that would have probably been smarter to move them in groups. Should have moved them in groups. That way, at the very least, I could take my time and heal up when needed. Yeah, I'm really smart. Should have moved them in groups. Twenty-five to twenty. <coughs> yeah, that is true. I guess income is cheap over there, like lower anyway. Suburban areas usually are, I guess. Oh my poor doggies! Why would you do this, to my poor doggies? Get rid of you.
He's not gonna move. Alright, uh... I feel like I should probably just wait around here, heal up my units. This is, there's a guy up there. I want to keep my eyes on him at all times. Another mountain right there. I think that's the next mountain we should probably go for. Just to get a scope of the area. Scout. Scout the area. We're gonna take our time here. We're gonna take our time working up to those barracks. We want, we want to make sure we're able to at least heal... These uh, units up here. Okay, Dougie's all healed up. Almost. Not yet. Not enough health. Okay, we're, gonna, we're just gonna keep this defensive formation for now. Heal up our units. Move to Fang uh, Fango, North Dakota. Huh? Annual income, 50 to 100 a year. Yes! Conjure up a gem known as a cherry stone, a powerful protective object. Aura provides a dramatic defense. Bonus. What? Really? I should probably save that. That would be useful. Alright, let's see. Gonna move the doggies slowly up. Around. I'm gonna get the dog up on this mountain right here. Up the doggy. Get another doggy up on this mountain right here. That way we could at least extend our fog of range view. There's probably gonna be a lot more units hidden in these trees here. Because we see one all the way up here already. That's not gonna move anywhere. I wanna take this town. I wanna take this town. Thank you, Alex. Okay, then. Apparently my laundry was, uh... in my sister's thing. Alright, whatever. Just toss that to the side for now. Uh, let's see... I want to take that over, but I'm pretty sure there's probably ambush units down here. I'm not gonna do that until I move the dog up here. We can take it nice and easy here. Take it nice and easy. Don't rush this. Don't rush this. You never know what's hiding for you in the fog of war. Aha! I knew it! Sneaky, sneaky. Sneaky! Ahahaha! I knew! I knew there was something fishy here! I knew there was gonna be something fishy here! Two more swords unit. I had a I had a feeling. I just had a feeling there was gonna be something over here. Okay, so how am I gonna do this? There's some barracks up here. I had a feeling. I just had a feeling. I knew something was fishy here. We could try to lure this guy out. Maybe. If I move a doggy up here, he's gonna be able to attack the doggy, right? What's my attack range on the uh, archer? Archer could snipe him. Could snipe him, but archer needs health. Let's see what I can for the archer right now. Alright, let's see. How are we going to do this? Because there's, there's some ambush units waiting for me right here. Let's see... I really want to take those towns. I'm 
doggy over here. You can't attack my doggy yet. It's this guy I'm gonna be worried about though. So if I could just keep keep south of this guy, keep south of him. I had a feeling. I just had a feeling. I had a feeling. I knew there was gonna go. Oh, oh, okay, he's running. Okay, I wasn't expecting you to go that way. Okay, he went that way. I wasn't expecting him to go that way. Fuck it, let's go for it. Take this, take this towel. He went north. The motherfucker went north. I wasn't expecting him to go north. I was expecting him to go south. Well, if I, I could kill him, for sure. You want to kill him? Get rid of him. He's definitely dead. Okay, we still got a unit here. Let's move the doggy here. Still gotta watch out for that unit. We, we're just slowly making our way up to the barracks up here. Because this is, this is basically what we need so we can at least start producing more units. What's the range on your... Okay, so only adjacent units. Got it. Move you here for now. Slow and easy. Never know what lurks in the fog of war. Here the doggy up. Go doggy, go! Just sent the dog to attack you. Okay, it looks clear to capture this town. May as well. A tactical advantage. He's gonna attack my doggies. Which isn't gonna do him any good. He's still gonna try to attack my doggies. I have the advantage, though. See, the barracks look clear, but that could be a trick. That could be a ruse. Uh, let's start moving my archer up a bit here, even though it needs to be healed. Okay, nope, so far so good. Everything looks clear so far. There's probably units here. I'm I'm gonna bet. I'm going okay, he just produced a unit okay, more units are spawning. <laughs> okay, he just captured a town. Okay, no, I'm gonna have to get those barracks now! He's 
he's, uh, he's capturing town. Okay. So he captured this town. That means there's some units there. He's... Okay, okay. I need to get those barracks, like, now. This is, this is gonna be important. I need to get those barracks now. There's some movement over there. Distance over here. Okay, so we need to get those barracks like now because he's he's starting to master those units and it's, it's starting to be a problem. I, I took way too long. Got rid of the initial. Ooh, he's got a mounted unit. Mounted units are gonna be a problem. Okay, nope, I need this now. I need it now. I need that now. This should be advantageous. This is very important to get right now. Interesting. Start moving these spear units up north. Let the dogs handle the stuff down south. Because they have cavalry already. Which is a problem. Which is a huge fucking problem. Poor doggies. My poor doggies. Calvary units like now, like yesterday. Get some of these up. Will you stop running with your fucking cavalry unit? Ooh, this is gonna be a problem. I'm gonna get swarmed real quick here. Took too long with the fog of war. 
I'm going to get swarmed really quick if I don't do something. They have doggies as well. I'm, I'm getting swarmed. I need to do something. Gotta do something. <laughs> Fog of War is always a bitch when you first encounter it. Cherry stones defend us. I'm going to lose some towns. I need to play very defensively right now. Towns down. They got archer units. I'm in trouble. Ooh, I am in big trouble. I have a spell for this. trouble uh let's see recruit more pikes because right now these the night down there is kind of an issue killing all my dogs retreat retreat north retreat northwards all right, uh, we need to we need to make some adjustments here. Uh, swords and pike, some pikes. Get some pikes out here. Need to get some pikes out. Do something. 
something about this fucking horse unit. Don't worry about it. I have a spell for this. Something about this pike unit. Oh, and this town. Oh man, I need to start recapping a lot of fucking cities. Because without these cities, I'm not going to be able to grow, grow, uh, well, make money. Our doggy units are running around. I basically need to build, like, a kind of a defensive oh. barrier for some Lightning blast! Ah! This. Hey, hey! Get rid of you. Hey, hey, hey! Okay, so this corner is kind of safe for now. Um. Need to get rid of you. I have a spell for this. <laughs> Take out my barracks, which I need. Okay, okay, defensive setup should be just about ready. Alright. <sighs> leave this doggy up there for now. I think I have to worry... Do I have to worry? Okay. We're going to focus on trying to clear out our southern border here. First and foremost, we got to clear out our southern border. I have a spell for this. These motherfuckers keep trying to take our city. Not let them take the city. Yeah, they're taking that city. All right. My city again. What's the, uh, Pikeman weak against? Pikeman is weak against dog units. No, wait. Not dog units, ranger units. So let's get a ranger unit out.
Get a ranger unit out here. Oh, we work on uh, trying to clear up here. are fucked. Oh, okay, yep, nope, knights are fucked. He keeps trying to go to my fucking town. I can't let him take it down. What are these weak against? Uh, Archer, War Doggies. He's gonna attack my Archer, which is gonna hurt a lot. up here. I think our southern border is basically safe for the time being. More or less.
several wall of pikes over here. Okay, we're just gonna roll like an entire wall of pikes up here because these pikes are much better when they're next to each other. Some, uh, let's get some doggies out. Scout over there. You gonna look for this stupid dog that's popping around here? Where is this dog run off to? I forgot to buy a unit, didn't I? I need this. Hey, hey! So, crap. Stones defend us. Okay. I'm just trying to make a line of spears right now. That's all I'm trying to do. Get another pikeman out right here. Okay, just trying to make sure our southern border is completely defended, so... <laughs> Seriously, those apartments are really cheap, Ryan. Not gonna lie. Real cheap apartments that I really wish I had.
Alright, so southern flank has been completely secured. Alright. Okay, so our southern flank is completely secured right now. Which means we don't have to worry about anything coming in from the south. Let's go ahead and start moving some of these units up north. Okay, southern units secured. Southern border is secured. So, let's see. How are we gonna do this? How are we gonna do this? Aha! There's all your units. Think you can hide from me, eh? To war! Alright, we don't have to worry about anything coming in from the south now, so... Just start, just start wailing away at them. Right the fuck now, we gotta start moving our way north. This is the, this is the plan, we gotta start moving north. See if we could at least make it to their barracks. If we could knock out their barracks, we win. Plus, we also need to find out where this, the, the enemy commander is. Enemy commander is somewhere in there. This is gonna hurt. I left an opening for him. Shit. They do a lot of damage. I was, um, I made a bad mis I made a mistake. I shouldn't have rushed. I shouldn't have gone in yet. This was a mistake. They do a lot of damage. Holy shit. This was a mistake. They do a lot of fucking damage, holy shit! <laughs> okay, no, I think I think it's time to pull the units back a bit here.
let's see. What's gonna be effective against the uh, pikes? They're they're pikemen. Uh, let me see. What are you weak against? You are weak against uh, archers. We should start lining up an entire roll of archers or some shit. So you're weak against oh that's sword sword Let's see archers archers are definitely your primary weakness you also send you up front to uh, start causing damage Unit is dead. It was a mistake. It was a mistake. Lightning blast! Ah! Starting to, they're starting to rush. Is because I made the mistake of rushing first, and that they're starting to rush now. I shouldn't have rushed. I shouldn't have rushed them. I shouldn't have tried to rush them. Formation. Lightning blast! <laughs> Slowly does it. up here just to view the map. Let me get a, uh, let's see, what are these weak against? These guys are weak against doggies. We should get more doggies. Yeah, let's get more doggies. Start, start. Yep, he's gonna start attacking me here. This should do the trick!
it down. That's good, that's good. He's gonna keep suiciding his units. Hey, if he suicides his unit into my commander unit, I'm fine with they that. should do the trick. Even though he's doing chip damage on my commander unit. Oh, there's Sed right there. Lightning blast! There's the enemy commander unit right there. I'm an enemy commander, not weak against anything in particular. Cherry stones, defend us! Throw that down there. Move you up here. Move you over here. Let's prepare you. Eighteen percent damage. He's gonna do a lot of damage to me. Ooh, I see a hit up north. Some of these units up. He's got pikes, right? So, what's the pike weak against? Pike is weak against archers mostly. But let's let's keep going for doggies. Let's keep going for doggies because the doggies do more attack as long as there's another doggy adjacent to the enemy they're attacking, which is going to be useful. I think the horsemen are gonna die here. Oh shit! One lived. Okay, well he's gonna die right now. This archer right here. I'm gonna move this archer over. Dougie over here. Let 
the night unit is kind of fucked here. Uh, we're gonna pull the night back. Give me another pup. Didn't die, what the fuck? It still lived. Hey, hey! Cut your production off here. Take this. A, uh, uh, a we have a beachhead at least. Let's just move you right here. Move you over here. Archer up. Night, which I'm just gonna pull back there. Uh, move you up here. Just to reveal the map, make sure nothing's coming up from up here. I don't think anything is gonna come from up there. Um, get another battle puppy here. Yep. How did you get there? Attacking my stronghold. Wow, he just fucking tore that shit down. He's trying to take it back. He, he's fighting to take this shit back. I'm not gonna let him take it back. Buddy, if you think I'm gonna let you take it back, you better think again. I ain't letting you take shit back, man. Get the fuck out of here. Okay, okay. He's gonna attack this again. Don't worry about that. I'll take that back. Just gotta make sure you ain't making money. He's gonna go ahead and smack you around a bit. Archer up. 
force. Knights are up. Reinforcement here. We'll wait here. We'll do here. We move this doggy up. Build a unit, build a unit, build a unit. Uh, let me get a... What is he got left? Well, we're gonna do knights. Doesn't look like he's gonna have a lot of units left here. Oh, he just made one. My poor doggies! Yep, he's going for my doggies. That doggy's done. Yep, that doggy's dead. He's still under retreat, so... Buster Knight. Get rid of you. Attack. Easy does it, easy does it. I'm gonna take over some of these towns over here on this side. Doggy up here, just to review the map. Doggy up here. Let's get a dog on one of these mountains here. Okay, so far everything's going great here. Alright, we've, we've managed to fight through the fog of war. Managed to gain a defensive foothold in the south, which is good. Plus, this is going good. This, is, this battle is going pretty smoothly right now. Just, uh, I guess, let me retreat this doggy for now. This dog needs to heal. Move the archer up. Everything's going smooth right now. Let's, let's start building more knight units here. Okay, you just built another doggy. Okay, my little crystal thing just shattered. It's fine. as well. Take this over. I know secondary victory condition is to just take over his uh, his barracks, which we can easily do. Lightning blast! Ow, that hurts. Easily take his barracks here. Let's see which unit should do the attacking though. Which unit can do the attacking? That is. Let's move you here. Get a nice bird's eye view of things. Reinforce. Dougie here. Reinforce. Get a doggy up here. There you are. Nope, that's his soldier. Where did he go? Where the fuck did he go? I have no idea where he went. Okay, let's let's just start focusing on his barracks right here. Just put some pressure on him, I guess. And this is the other victory condition. I could either defeat the commander or I could just steal their barracks. And stealing their barracks seems to be the easier way. Do it. Because I have no idea where the enemy commander is right now. Get rid of this 
doggy. Night's up. Alright, this, this victory is basically mine. Guaranteed mine. Had to establish a uh, strategic foothold in the south first, but, you know, once we did, it, it was smooth sailing from there, more or less. There he is. That's okay, it doesn't matter because your fucking barrack is mine. This is what I need. Easy. Yeah, I mean, look, it took 30-something turns, but we kicked your ass, at least. This isn't the end of the hunt. It set. will catch yeah, you! Sure. Good luck. <laughs> there you are. Who are these strangers? We're <gasps> invaders. Trespassers. That's done the destruction of Gloomwoods. Sedge caught them. Sedge defeated them. <laughs> oh, wow, what a lying son of a bitch. Green finger... Huh? What a lying son of a bitch! This took a lot. This took longer than expected. 35 turns. Ooh, ooh, we got a branching... We got... We got branching... Ooh, we got a branching path here! Alright, so what do we got here? This is alone in the woods. Caesar finds some villager... Oh, this is gonna be a fucking village... Village escort mission. And what is this? Sedge defeated, Emmerich faces... Okay, so... Uh, let's let's try the uh, village escort mission here. This is probably gonna go really badly. Ah! Outlaws. Hand over your valuables and no one will get hurt. Sniff, sniff. What have we here? Wolf, wolf. Yep. Be off with ya. Can't an outlaw make a dishonest living in these woods without being hounded by armored beasties? You don't intimidate me. He intimidates me. <laughs> yeah, and me. Just get this villager back to the camp and lock him up, will ya? Alright, so I'm, I'm guessing this is probably a side mission. Seems like a side mission. We're probably gonna have Caesar. Couple of units. Ooh, this is gonna be a castle siege. Commander bought us to a tumbled-down fortress. Interesting. We better explore. Okay, defeat all the outlaws. No problem. Let's see. So we got Fog of War on. Uh, it looks like we're starting things off in a castle siege. Sure. Doggies, attack! Wait. Caesar. These doggies, uh... T -t -t -t. Yeah, do much better damage when there's another unit next to him, huh? I wonder what Caesar's ability is. Ooh, I don't want to risk losing my doggies. What's your movement range? You can attack the spear. You know what? That's fine. And turn. I got the spears. Oh, oh, fuck me. Iron Hulk. gonna hurt. Oh, 
Oh, that really does hurt. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Doggies are injured. Go Caesar! Go get him! Oh wow, Caesar comes with both archer units. Cool. Oh, you're just gonna... Okay. Caesar comes with archer units. That's nice to know. It's gonna hurt! My poor doggies! Doggies. Okay, wait. So how do I heal up my units anyway? Like, do I just wait and don't heal up? Let's wait. Trying to see if this would actually naturally... He looks so inspiring, inspiring. Spent units have a second... Ooh. Okay, but I need to heal up, so... I'm really hoping this heals. It doesn't look like they're healing. Uh, okay, so... This is gonna be troublesome. This is going to be problematic because I am a couple of units down right now. Not over there. There's another gate over there. Lots of gates. Okay, so Inspire does that. Okay, now that I think about it, I may have fucked up here. That's gonna kill my doggy. This is gonna kill my doggies. Alright, so I shouldn't have moved this down here, then. I shouldn't have moved him down here. He's got archers as well. My archers are currently fucked. Okay, yep, my archers are fucked. This is not good for my archers. You. It's gonna 
hurt. God damn it, and they have a night unit now. Okay, I definitely lost this battle. Definitely for sure lost this battle. I for sure lost this battle. There goes my fucking archers. Somehow my archers lived. What the fuck? Of fucking mobs. Oh boy. Oh boy. This ain't good. It's not good because I have no health. I have a bunch of units with no health. I totally fucked up here. Oh, thank fucking god, reinforcements! Okay, so, that means there's gonna be a lot more enemies down this way. Oh, thank fucking god, reinforcements. Okay, let me just quickly reposition my units here. Okay, so every prisoner I rescue is basically reinforcements. Oh, that was such a bad idea. That dog is fucked.
What the? F okay, well, doggies are gone. Hey, hey, hey. Bye, doggies. Sorry. They got doggies as well. That's gonna deal a lot of damage to my knight. Not good. Get rid of you. That didn't do a lot of damage. There we go, there we go, there we go. Just weak them down a little bit here. Come on. Okay. Yeah He's gonna suicide charge into my knight, sure. Okay. So far, so good. There's probably more. Pr there's one more prisoner there, probably. So let's see. We need. We need to carefully plan this. There they come. Yeah! This is gonna hurt. Alright, alright.
so far. So far, so good. Move this knight down here. good so far we're doing good so far barely surviving this side mission Spear unit. Hey, hey! Trying to do this with the least amount of damage possible, but Get rid of you. Ooh, and there's a, there's a, there's a unit hey, down there. Got a doggy unit as well. Get rid of this. Ooh, and there's a night unit down there. Problematic. Oh, this is problematic. I knew there was units down there, but I didn't think there was going to be this many units. units down there, I just kind of miscalculated how many there were. Get rid of this, get the, uh, yep, get some reinforcements, we need reinforcements. Okay. 
Okay, we got more spear units that we could utilize. That knight unit is totally hey! fucked. Sorry, knight unit. Hey! He's gonna charge my archers. And get killed. Easy. You. Let's just uh, reposition a couple of units here. Alright, before we break these doors down, before we break these doors down, we're gonna just quickly reposition a few units. this dog who let a dog in here this is no way to run a professional outfit we can't just have animals wandering into our camp oh shut it football that's it everyone in here and help me fight this dog yee good thing i took a defense Fire. Get rid of you. Attack you. Archers in the back as well. This is gonna hurt. This is gonna hurt. This is gonna hurt. Archers.
Program you. Fuck! I've used up so much, so many units here. All right, that's okay. We we basically got this in the bag right now. This 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 this, this, uh, this is pretty much over. We got this in the bag now. Easy does it. And that should be all the bandits. Yeah, you can't take on such a majestic hound. I've I've lost a lot of units. I've lost like almost a hundred percent almost a hundred percent. Good boy! Almost I like seriously, I I don't even think I have any of the original units I've even started with. Play as Caesar is okay. Yep. All right. Well, that one's done. Next battle. Sedge defeated. Emmerich faces a new floor and threat. <sighs> I am the ruler of the forest, the gloom woods, and the home and hunting ground of my tribe. Why do you enter our land armed and armored as you are? <laughs> In shining steel with shields and swords. You see, Greenfinger, they are invaders. They've come to slay the floor. <laughs> Slay no. well. No, Sedge, this is a green finger to <laughs> Your invasion ends here, he will be I mean, look, it's it's all a big misunderstanding, dude. Alright, well. What the fuck is that? Oh, this is gonna hurt. Oh wow, that uh that's gonna hurt. Okay. I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> Uh, Gloom Giants are forced to be reckoned with. We need to try and keep them at a distance using our trebuchet. While our trebuchet are unable to move and attack at the same turn, their range and destructive power render them immense threat to our enemies. Of course, trebuchets can't hit what they can't see. Sending battle pups into the mountains will provide us with... Alright, so it's going to be very important to, uh... So trebuchets and pups are going to be the most important units that we have on hand. So. Hey, hey. This. hey, hey welcome back, Cameron. You, you missed quite a bit. I mean, we're, we're basically getting into the meat of the game at this point. Alright, so let's see. We're gonna have those giant thingies to deal with. What are those things called? I think we should be able to... Yep, over... Right, can we... Or is it in the codex? Might be in the codex. Codex, there we go. So what are those giant things? That would be the... What are those giant things? Oh. What am I fighting right now? I am fighting... Where is it? What are you weak against? Where is it? This. Gloom Giants. Alright, so Gloom Giants. Gloom Giants, we know they're weak against trebuchets. Too bad it doesn't actually tell me anything here. Alright, so... Wait. The, the Duggies, Duggies are not gonna handle trebuchet that thing, bro. Well, Alright, so Gloom Giants are gonna be an issue here. 
We're gonna have to slowly move my trebuchets up with the pups, while at the same time capture stuff. Okay, so what what's my mission objective here? Mission objective is to I don't see my mission objective. Oh, destroy the enemy stronghold. Alright. The enemy stronghold is that thing right here. You can see they have... They're currently making 200 gold. No, 300. Because stronghold counts as one. Let's see, we're gonna need... We're gonna need a lot of battle pups. Send out these battle pups, yo. Okay, they're, they're making 300 gold now. Alright, let me think, let me think. I think ideally I should probably start off with at least a defensive line. I'm gonna move these pups up one, one at a time, slowly. down here. Gonna have to move this pup over. I don't want to accidentally wreck my ch only trebuchets. Send this knight over here. Okay, right now I don't think they're this far out yet. Um, but it looks like they are approaching from the north. Because that's where their, their uh, workshop is. Their barrack. Okay, so their barracks are up here. They're mostly they're mostly gonna be coming in from the north. All right. Uh, let's see, what is this? This is a regular pike, right? Yeah, pike. So let's. Uh, we should probably. I'm, I'm thinking we we need to buff up our defenses here. They're they're gonna come in from the north most of the time, so we're gonna have to have most of our defenses focus up north, I believe. Uh, let's get a range. I can't do a ranger yet. Uh, let's keep growing down some puffs. I need a. I need a. Open up more of this map. This fog of war is really annoying. All right, they just capped another building. Here. There we go. Capture this. This should be advantageous. We need to get a nice defensive formation set up here. Uh, one, two. All right. Move this up here. Ooh, I see you there. I see you there. So they got mostly... What is this? That's an archer unit, right? Yeah, that is an archer unit. Archer units weak against doggies. We can just do that. Let's see. We have a lot of units in the range of archers right now. Wanna tr let's, uh, let's get some pikes going. Let's get some pikes going. Start capping some of their places. What is this? That's still a forest tile. Yep. Here you go. It's archery. Oh, my poor doggies. Oh, and they have a... Let's get rid of your archery unit. Archers are going to be in the way. Get rid of that. Oh, no. 
Oh. There's his gloom thingy. Get some pikemans up in here. He's not dead. Oh. Doggy in the woods. Alright. This thing. Ooh, he's gonna attack my knight. My knight is fucked. My knight is fucked. <laughs> eh, sorry, knight. I saw that coming from a mile away. Doggies again. Dog okay, he's got my doggies. Yep. Oh, okay, no, that doggie's dead too. God damn it! Stop killing all my units! Oh, he has another gloom thing around somewhere. They don't kill it. Oh, yes, thank fuck. Thank you for committing suicide on that. Fire in the hole! Fire in the hole! Kill my dogs. Think, let me think, let me think. I don't think he's gonna move. Mm. Definitely gonna need more trebuchets later. Let's get rid of this. This should do the trick! <laughs> Gonna need more buggies. Let's see. Just in case, we'll build another trebuchet. This is gonna hurt! This is gonna hurt! Lightning blast! Attacking my trebuchets. There's another gloom thing right there. Archer's incoming. Trying to push up the defensive line here, but it's not doing so well. Lightning blast! 
think, let me think. is gonna hurt. My commander is taking way too much damage here. Need to pull him back. Risky. Ooh, my pups. My poor pups. My poor puppies. God damn it. Ow. This should do the trick. They have another gloom thingy and it's gonna piss me off. This should do the trick! City, take the city. We need the city under our control. Uh, there's only 10 minutes left in this stream as well, by the way, guys. Get some puppies. Puppies. I should have known this battle was going to take longer than half an hour. I had a feeling. Especially with Fog of War in play, man. Fog of War is really annoying. This should do the trick. There's another gloom thing over there. 
in the hole. turn. Let's see how much I could finish in, uh, ten minutes. Probably not enough. This is gonna hurt! Ow! I have a spell for this. Stones defend us. Do that. Puppy up here. Start sending some pikes to the uh, south, and um, you know what? I think this is this is pretty much where we're probably going to uh, to end us here because we're we're pretty much out of time anyway because we have five minutes left. Uh, but uh, yeah, let's just go ahead and mission. Ooh, wait, I can't I can't save it, can I? Oh boy, I'm just gonna have to do this all over again. That's not fun. That's not gonna be fun. Yeah, that's not gonna be fun at all. I'm gonna have to do this all over. Okay, I underestimated how long this turn, this uh, this 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 one was gonna last. Totally underestimated. I mean, I guess that's the point of strategy games, right? Turn-based strategy games. They do take a long, long time to uh, finish one game. Not gonna lie. <laughs> All right, well, I, I guess we're just going to have to replay this map uh, again from the beginning. At least this time we kind of have an idea of what we're doing, sort of. Just going to have to line up a defensive line of trebuchets and uh, yeah, just, just hope for the best, basically. Uh, but yeah, that, that's pretty much it for tonight, guys. Uh, this game is available on every system. It, there is cross-platform. I do want to stream this game and play with you guys uh you know the the uh four four player verse mode stuff that that's all cross-platform all right it, so like you know if this game interests you you want to like it, it's twenty dollars it's twenty dollars uh on steam on playstation 4 on xbox one on the uh, nintendo switch 
Uh, you know, if, if you want to join in this game, you know, just play a couple of rounds on stream or something, it's just... Yeah, you know, I, I will totally, I'm totally down to be hosting uh, some multiplayer sessions, because why not? Anyway, uh, that, that's pretty much it for tonight, guys. I am Max Hack. Streams are every Monday through Friday, starting at 7 p.m. Eastern Time. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this Advance Wars slash Fire Emblem uh, successor, I guess. And uh, I will see you all tomorrow. That's, that's pretty much it. I am Jason. I am out of here.